It's a nerd, it's a lame, it's Mr. Clintastic, and I'm here once again with an Ikoria Layer of Behemoth's quick draft on MTG Arena. So let's see, what do we have going on here? So we have Zerda Don Waker, not really a big fan of that card, just a 3-3 elemental in my opinion. I like Drenna Stinger, I like Of One Mind, Capture Spheres, decent. I'm going to go with Dranith Stinger. If I can end up in cycling, I'm not going to turn it down. Yesterday I tried to end up with it, but it didn't go too well. Mm, I think I'm going to just grab a checkpoint officer. It's cheap, and you can just keep recurring the power of it. The ability, rather. Divine Arrow, just a good removal spell in red-white. <clears throat> Blade Banish, I guess I can go with that. I'm going to start slinging these Instants and Sorceries in the sideboard for now. We could grab the Imposing Vontasaur. I'm just going to get the Blade Banish. I'm a fan of Pyroceratops, so I'm just going to grab the Swallow Hole. Ooh. Do we want to end up in Bant? We could just slide right into Bant. Maybe. But that's a high possibility. Almighty Brushwag is pretty decent. We need draw power. Always need that draw power. I'm just going to go with the Brushwag. Try to make sure we have enough creatures if we do decide to pivot. Mm, I'm just going to grab this mana here i really think we might we might end up in bant the the cycle strategy just doesn't seem to be coming together which is okay i'm just gonna grab the zagath crystal It looks like we're going to have the appropriate mana for Bant if we would just get some some decent spells. All right. Interesting opener. What do we have here? All right. Everquill Phoenix. It is a flying four drop with mutate. Whenever this creature mutates, create a red artifact token named Feather with pay one, sacrifice Feather, return target Phoenix card from your graveyard to the battlefield tapped. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, that's cool and all. But I think we're really on this bent strategy. And there's also another Gnar here. I think the Gnar is pretty good. I want to play it. I'm going to go with the Gnar. I'm going to abandon red. At the moment. And we're just going to kind of be bent. Because we do have Swallow Hole, Divine Arrow, Blade Banish. We have some good things. Some good removal in white that I really don't want to get rid of. All right, pacifism, easy. See, even more good things in, in white that we're getting. 
Another Nar? Jeez. Do I want excavation mold? Do I want just another evolving wilds? Like we're gonna have enough playable creatures, I think that's the question. I don't wanna put cards into my graveyard whatsoever. We could grab fully grown and have more interaction. I'm just going to grab another evolving wilds here. All right. Guess we'll go with frost links. There's another brush wag. We already have one blade banish. I'm just gonna go with the brush wag to make sure we have things to mutate onto. I'm not a fan of the glider. The glider has not has not been the greatest. Um, we could just get another mana. Just make sure our mana is just like on point throughout the whole game. White, blue, green. Ooh, sweet. We got a baby Godzilla. That slots in excellently. I wish this was the right color crystal. That would be so nice. I'm actually grab this survivor's bond. Just to have access to it. Fully grown came around. I'm glad I didn't pick that earlier. Do we want garrison cat? Yeah, let's grab a garrison cat. Thieving otter. And Mothra's great cocoon. Okay. Okay. We got some stuff going on. We got some stuff going on here. Clearly can't run the ruinous ultimatum. That would be nice. But we're not anywhere near red or black. This isn't the greatest pack for us. I'll be happy with like a draw spell in this pack. I mean, this facet reader, I suppose. I guess Boone of the Wish Giver is a draw spell. Like it'll really help us refill our hand. I'm gonna grab it. And it has cycle in case we can't play it. Ooh, a symbiote. We needed that. There's another checkpoint officer. There is a checkpoint officer, but there's a glow. What's it? a glowstone recluse? Whenever it mutates, put two counters on it. 
I'm not gonna pass that up. Another baby Godzilla? Yes, please. So we have a lot of we have a lot of access to mutate. I'm hmm. Thieving Otter has a higher rating than this reconnaissance mission, but I think reconnaissance mission could be good. Like, are we gonna draw out our whole deck? I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna go with my gut there. Okay, Fertilid allows us to find some lands. All right, I think that, I mean, this draft went kind of well. We got a lot, a lot of mutate. We have a lot of mutate and we have a lot of good removal. I think I missed an additional swallow hole. So I'm gonna bring in Divine Arrow, Swallow Hole, Pacifism, Blade Banish, and probably Fully Grown, just to make sure we're able to interact just a little bit more. I wanna draw cards. I'm not a fan of King Sight Mentor. I'm not really a fan of Thieving Otter. Not a fan of the serval. And honestly, I don't even have to keep the cat. In my opinion, I could just run with Mothra's Great Cocoon instead. And we have three of the Brushwags. Do we want to cut mana? Because we can cycle these. See what the, the curve's looking like. 2.4 even yeah we don't need so much mana white is a splash so we can cut one piece of that there the dicks it looks like it's primarily uh, I don't have to guess I can look mostly green Could probably cut a blue land too and instead have we don't have a lot of humans in the build we could bring in thieving otter and i mean we could have a plummet yeah all right let's go with a little something something like that What, what, what reflect? Oh, I didn't even realize I had that art. We'll do that there. And then get a screenshot.
All right. Let's fire this off. <clears throat> Going against Papa Mario. Our hand looks like absolute garbage, but hopefully we'll draw into the things we need. We can start with a couple brush wags or even the symbiote next turn. Uh -oh. oh man. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. I mean, I knew what I was getting into when I kept this hand, but we we still have playable creatures. All right. Like blue or white will be great here. And maybe I could run 15 lands. Sweet. All right. So we're just going to get blue mana so we can play Thieving Otter. Ooh, we also got Baby Godzilla. Yeah, we're still gonna play Thieving Otter. We're kinda behind because we don't have mana. But we do have a board. cycle <clears throat> oh geez we're still not hitting our lands I think we are 15 lands in the deck now Not trample. We really need our white mana. I mean, maybe I should block with it. Yeah, good one. We're not gonna survive this. Like, our, our white mana came way too late. 
I'm a since we're three colors, I'll run 16, 17. Cause that thieve and otter did exactly what I thought it was gonna do. Nothing. <clears throat> we disrespected the mana gods and they punished us in kind. All right, this is the kind of hand we're talking about. Alright, are they going to get off the first mutate? Alright, that's nice, that's nice. That's good for us, actually. So we just drop green, blue. Wait, 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 wait. Should we cycle? I, I think so. I mean, I probably should have played Evolving Wilds last turn anyways. It's my, my fault. Alright. Sweet. No attacks. I don't want to take the chance of them killing our guy. Like, we're really set up to dominate the game at this point. They play a big guy, we blade, blade banish it. We should be taking over this game. All right. Then we can pump here. We're just gonna attack those two guys. All 
All right, we'll just um, do this here. Sweet. All right, so we're still in great shape. And we can start pumping our brush wags. Oh. That was all their creatures. That was really just like all their creatures. All right, they're gonna take this damage. Sweet. Ooh. Mmm. That's what's up. That's what's up. And they're still at three mana. That's painful. That's. They spent all that time wanting to kill the Nar. Like it's already done its work. It's damage. Oh yeah, they're in horrid shape. All right. The brush wag is top quality in my opinion. Especially in this late part of the game. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. They're hitting nothing but gas in the graveyard. So we can pump both of our guys. See, that's, I don't like ex excavation mode. Boom. Our one drops gave us more value than those guys. Oof. And they have trample. Jesus Louises. Oh man, they gotta ram through us. Alright, well. Guess we're just gonna activate ability. Activate ability. Crush. Yep. We clinch them wins, you know what I'm saying? We clinch them up. Alright. I like that one. That w that was way smoother. All right, burbs.
All right, I am back. I like I liked how that went. That was excellent, and it was really fun. I wouldn't mind having an anticipate in the build, but I'm not gonna. Beggars can't be choosers. That that went really well. I definitely need a new webcam so that when I sit back in my chair, it doesn't make the whole background just go all out of whack. I gotta lean up, sit back. We'll keep. We have evolving wilds to find our green mana. I'm not gonna let them know what, we're, what we are off the bat. I'm gonna try to disguise our trumpeting Nar a bit. Mutate four. So So we gotta play it this way. And it kind of signals that we're, we're planning to mutate next turn. But it would be nice to glowstone recluse that. Like they could rumbling, rumbling us right now. There's a multitude of removal spells they could run on us right now. We're just hoping that they're more willing to try to set up their own strategy than than disassemble ours. Yep, they're targeting. They're definitely trying to target the Nar. <clears throat> I just felt like that was our best line of play if we were going to do anything and it, and it paid out. Sweet. Played the wrong mana. Well, no, I didn't play the wrong mana. That was our only option. Sweet. this death touch no all right that's six damage that's six damage so in two turns we can we can draw four cards oh that's gonna be disgusting Swallow hole. Okay. Okay. I mean, that's to be expected, but we already got a 3 3 payoff off of it. I didn't want to waste that turn on mana because we're definitely drawing four cards next turn.
they have a way to take out our brush wag? I wouldn't doubt it. That's frustrating. That's that's really frustrating. Like are they just are they stream sniping like oh my jeez. That's so frustrating. Literally like one turn away from a big draw turn. They just took it away from us. Glider. All right, we made it. They're not going to be happy about that. They're not going to be happy about that at all. Whew. Got to refill our hand. A turn late, but we got to refill our hand. Yeah, we're going to take those hits. We can Mothra's Great Cocoon right into Gnar next turn. And possibly even Swallow Ho. Oh, jeez. We're gonna hold the forest in case they make us discard again. Rock slide. See, it's a good thing we've we were able to get value off of our things. They have one, two blockers. So we're gonna run out checkpoint officer. We're gonna run out reconnaissance mission. We're gonna give this symbiote a little bit of juice. No attacks. <clears throat> so now we have even more draw power on the board. All right, sweet. Now they're wanting to get in. We can double. You know what? No blocks.
Opponent's not in good shape here. And the whip, the reconnaissance mission is going to be excellent. All right. We'll just draw, you know, forever cards. Yes. 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 All right, well, what should we do? I guess we'll Evolving Wilds. Activate with the ability. I'm gonna baby Godzilla. And end the turn. Yeah, we'll be losing something, but we'll lose the brush wag. Yep. But that's just not going to cut it. Frost links. Excellent. Alright, GG's. Sweet. Oof. I like this build. Sorry for the exhaustion. That's what happens when you live life, I suppose, get old. Ugh, can't keep that. Garbage. Opponent, what are you gonna do? Eh. We'll get rid of a symbiote. We're missing green mana already. But maybe baby Godzilla pull, pull us out of it. We really need that uh, green mana. Really need that green mana. There it is. All right. Do we want to? We. I'm just gonna start with the symbiote and then drop baby Godzilla. Maybe that was wrong. Because I do want to drop Fertile next turn, but actually there's no reason to really drop Fertile next turn. We have all our mana. <clears throat> I 
There's no reason to rush the Nar either, though. Yeah, we're just gonna fertile it and next turn, I suppose. Find two lands that'll be like drawing cards for us. Opponents on the mono white strategy, so we're not dying exceptionally fast. Those land, I mean, these covers are cool though. Yeah, we're definitely doing that twice. Boom. We can do this at instant speed. Yeah, no attacks. Next time we're gonna have tons of mana. Fertile, it's awesome. Wow. Now we can block with it and then find more mana to use. Play Baby Godzilla right into the Gnar? What? We can even, yeah. <clears throat> then we still have a mana in hand. Nice. That's that's really nice. All right. We're block. This will cost three to mutate. Can we, can we do this? Let's see. Sweet! Wow. Alright. <clears throat> Oof. Okay. That what a turn. What a turn. What a turn for us. Wow. Baby Godzilla into Nar into whatever the other card is. They kind of stack these weird, in my opinion. The mutations. Oh, Glowstone, Glowstone Recluse. Who? There's really no no reason. Like, can we get an profitable attack anywhere? Like, they block here and they make another token. I say we drop the Almighty Brushwag that has Trample. And I guess they're not gonna swing in because Nar has Reach. Hmm. Yeah. We need more action. We definitely need more action. Club Warden, okay. That's not good. And we have no way to get Mothra off the field.
I don't, I don't think so. From what I'm seeing, we don't really have a way to get Mothra off the board. Black here. Oh, jeez. I, I meant to block there. Could kill that, but I don't think it'll do anything. All right. <sighs> Yeah, we'll let that die once. I'm missing so many triggers. Not I'm not paying attention with my brush wag. I could have pumped, had four more damage in there. I was looking at something else, I'm sorry. Like worried about this Mothra. I was looking at my deck list and Kind of forgetting about my almighty brush wag. So let's see if this works here. We'll just target that. Tap down this. But they should really be at 16. That was bad playing. Like if I lose, it's really completely my fault. I gave them so much advantage. Not getting an extra four damage in, well three. So I guess they should really be at 17. Not a complete game loss, but still. Sweet. We got that dang old Mothra off the board. So we'll drop a land. Tap down our Nar. This only becomes a four. I don't think that's... That was too risky. I don't want to lose it. We can double pump next turn. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> They got their black mana. That's not good. I thought they were mono white. It's my turn. My fault. Totally my fault. But we do need to draw some action. Like we had big advantage on this opponent. But they made some really excellent plays too. Why did he not get back Mothra? Am I missing something? Oh! Oh, Mothra's exiled. Sweet. Alright. So now we can really get in some action.
I'm not gonna miss my triggers this time. Oh, that's what they care about. That's not enough. Oh, they probably have a... Something somewhere, I guess. Um... Okay. Are you si- <sighs> I'm losing myself this game. This is like the worst game of magic ever played. Yeah, I did exile it, life snuffery. Don't judge me for my horrid gameplay right now. Opponents should be what, like close to giving up by now, but I just played so bad. I'd be forgetting about these guys. Yeah. Just death touch. Maybe since I've forgotten about it so many times, the opponent has forgotten about it. We'll tap something to theirs. And we're just gonna start slamming in. All right. They're just gonna keep gaining life there. Did they forget to... Okay. So they got rid of a brush wag. They still got their one five. Poacher. They're still gaining life in the air. Now they're gonna tap our guy down every turn. Yeah. We can't swing in. This is what I mean. This is all my fault. I played this game horribly, not paying enough attention. We're just gonna keep tapping our guy down. Like they're at nine. We should definitely be close to winning and we're not.
Yep. Too many combat tricks, too many missed triggers. And I really did some cool stuff in the beginning. Oh, uh, this is... I thought YouTube's gonna go crazy. They're gonna be like this. Yeah. And then, there we go. Like, <laughs> the obvious mana flood to make it... To really put salt in the wound. Like, the deck is good. I just really just... Just completely befunkled that. Let's see if I can redeem myself. Boom. Really just funkled that up. Was not used to the brush wag. Was just talking about how good brush wag was. Alright. We'll keep the hand. Opponent goes first. We have all of our colors. Let's see if we can do a little some some here. Dorat, okay. All right. Let's try. Kill Dorat, the perfect pet. Neutralize. Nice. Next turn, we'll play Reconnaissance Mission. Hopefully, Lord Dracus. Yeah, this is going to be nice. Reconnaissance mission. All right. That's going to make them not really want to swing in like that, but they ha do have the neutralize for us. They play Pyroceratops. We can play Trumpeting Gnar. Checkpoint officer. Sweet. All right. Whew. Trying to redeem myself. Reconnaissance mission is looking kind of nice. Whoa, 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 whoa. We can pay two. Tap that down. No, tap this down. Let's see. White mana. Play the Gnar. Mm. 
totally cool. So they cycle away the neutralize. All right, we'll get rid of evolving wilds. Whew. So do they have it here? They have five damage. We have nine life. A grip full of spells. Sweet. Sweet. All right. So we can blade banish that. Tap that. Sweet. GG's. GG's, lover boy. GG's. That's a rank up. All right. And that wasn't an embarrassing one. Jeez. All right, give me a minute. I'm so sorry. Sometimes coffee just, coffee and water just runs through me like the thundering rapids of Niagara, man. <sighs> it's that old age, I'm telling you. And then fruits and stuff like grapes and things. It doesn't make it any easier. Where's... Boom, the wish giver, where have you been? We needed you. We've been drawing a ton of cards. We've been drawing a ton of cards today. I have no complaints. All right. Are we gonna cycle? We got four lands in hand. Maybe not. We gotta turn, we gotta play next turn. We'll slam this symbiote. Slam Evolving Wilds next turn. Alright, we'll just slam Fertilid. And we're just gonna attack. They can block if they want. I'm guessing there's some kind of Naya cycling. I really love the detail you gave, uh, Life Snuffery. 
You're right, though. You're right. What did they play? Alright, we, we're not too concerned about that. We'll go get our white mana. And we'll swing in here. But yeah, that's what's causing me to just have to bounce out so many times. Next turn we can draw four cards. I think that's just gonna hurt. Naturalist. Naturally. Naturalist. Naturally. They swing in, we block. Cause you know, we don't wanna take all that damage. We go get more mana out of the deck. Mothra's great cocoon. We'll just go get more mana out of the deck. And then draw four cards. Sweet. We drew a lot of lands. To have thinned our deck so much. Alright, I'm going to try to block. Sweet. We needed that gone. We got a lot of options going on here. Let's slam down this planes. It's a good thing we drew all those cards because my goodness we weren't going to get anything else for a minute. Three lands in hand. Good thing we have that pacified. Tap two on tap human music control tap target creature. I don't want to take any chances. We'll take six. We got a couple life gains here. We'll just swing in. We'll frost links. The naturalist. And then let the thornwood falls come in. Tap. Pass. We're not in bad shape here. If they swing in, we'll try to combat trick it up. I'd be loving some of these like foreign names. Michael Tim Timia. Timio. I can't even say it right, like, geez. My name just sounds so basic. Clinton. All right, we're just going to something like that. Gain some life. Yeah, we're gonna, we're crashing in here. Ooh. Okay. We're gonna hit him with the nice. Give them a sense of security. Yep. <clears throat> All right. <sighs> we swing in full.
He, I mean, he might have an 11-11 Godzilla, but if they don't, if they just drew a land there, they're sunk. That's why I went on and attacked, even though I had nothing. I mean, we do have Blade Banish. Counting their mana. Ooh. <laughs> Is this the thing you're talking about? Titans Rex. Yeah. Wow, you called it. You called it. That's what's up. Life snuffery. That's what's up. <laughs> but Blade Banish would definitely um snuff that out. Snuffery. I'm going for the win. I mean, I'm not gonna just not go for the win. Alright. They drew into something. We'll hit him with the nice. And we can't blade banish. Oh jeez. Alright. Oh we can blade banish now. Is he gonna swing he's not gonna swing in? Yay! Yeah, big confident. He was big confident. But guys, we need like one of our mutators. Are you serious? <laughs> we have so much mana. Like we should have nothing but gasoline coming up. He has an answer for baby Godzilla? It's getting to the wire. We've drawn literally every land in the deck. Are you serious? Are we about to lose? Are you serious? We're about to lose. We drew so many extra cards. Wow. <laughs> All right. Well, that's 14 mana for you. We saw none of our uh, trumpeters. Yeah, running 17 lands, but, you know, we drew, what, we're, we're running 17 lands, we drew four extra cards, we thinned three times, with our, twice with our Fertilid, actually twice with Evolving Wilds, so, that was Variance, I'm not, I'm just gonna chalk that up to Variance there, and, 
I threw a whole game away, so I'm not even going to be, like, mad, upset about it. But if you enjoy my content, please be sure to hit that follow button. Be sure to hit me up on YouTube where you'll be able to catch a replay of this 24 hours after the stream.